everyone, this is Gadget Trish, and if you have some leftover money from your tax return, or if your parents have some leftover money, I have seven things that I think are must-haves from 2012. So let's just get into it. First, we have something from the Legacy of Love. Yes, they have their own designs. It was designed by a fan with famous Michael Jackson phrases. So even though I personally don't have one, my girl Carlene does and she loves the shirts. So if anybody knows me personally and don't know what to get me, I love Legacy of Love shirts and bags and accessories. Next, we have Funko. Funko has these cute figures. There's five to be exact, but since I'm in a bad mood, here's the bad figure. But um, they're like under 20 bucks. Get them while they're affordable. And um, tell them. Ooh. Next, we have Michael Bush um, book here. It came out last year. The King of Style, dressing Michael Jackson. If you ever wanted to know some of the thought process of Michael Jackson's um, um, outfits after 87, the bad era and beyond, this is the book. Shout out to Michael Bush for coming to New York. Hopefully you'll come back again during Michael Jackson season. Give us a call. Keeping with the theme of bad, did you get the Bad 25 picture disc? It's available on Amazon.com and Rock and Soul in the 35th Street area. Bad 25 Deluxe version is my favorite version because it's in the middle. It's not too cheap, not too expensive. It's this sweet spot of $40. You can get this on Michael Jackson's website, Amazon.com, and I got mine at Best Buy. So check that out. Shout out to my boy, Austin Brown. He gave us Highway 85 in December, just a few months ago, mixtape, I love this. As a matter of fact, Austin Brown has been my top played artist in the last three months, according to my last FM scan. And um, Austin, a lot of people are asking for a hard CD. This is not an actual CD, guys. I actually just printed out the cover. Austin, if you are selling the CD, people are asking me, so Austin, is there a hard copy to buy? All right. This is my number one recommendation. Why? Because it's a Jackson 5, duh. Now this is called the Jackson 5, come and get it, the Rare Pearls. This was the number one gift I gave out last year and if you were one of those people, you know who you are, you know it's a must have. Um, this particular set was said to be limited edition, but if you don't want all the bells and whistles and you just want the music, cause guys, it's all about the music, then go to Amazon or iTunes.com just to download it. So get it while you can. Now before I go guys, even though it's nice to receive gifts, it's also important to give and to be part of the Jackson legacy is to give. Now you give of your time, your money, or both, but don't forget to give. And um, shout out to the community, the MJ community, the Jackson family community, the Austin Brown. You, I mean, just the whole umbrella of what makes this, this. So um, hope you guys enjoy your tax season and if you owe money, I hope it goes well. And until my next post, Gadget Trish is out. Bye.